hello everyone welcome back to selenium web driver tutorial and in this video we are going to see some of the most commonly used browser commands in selenium web driver so normally the browser commands helps us to get some information from the browser so these are the four things which we are going to see now first one is a get title so the get title helps us to get the title of the web application so if you want to see the title you can see that in two ways one is uh, by seeing the html source code or either you can see at the top of the uh, browser you can see the tabs in each tab the title will be populated the title of the current web application will be populated here so here you can see that google it's the title of uh, this uh, link so you can alternately check the title as well so we are going to get the title and get current url so get current url helps us to get the current url for example we have navigated to google.co.in and we have done some operations so let's assume that we have done some operations like submitting the form or entering some inputs and after that uh, the url may change and if you want to check what the url is then we can get that current url using this get current url method and get page source so get page source helps us to get the entire source code of the current page and difference between close and quit that we will see later first we will cover one by one so in order to get the title we should use driver dot get title so if you see the written type of the get title is string so I, i'm going to put that inside the sysout so i want to know the title so i'm just adding a caption title is and now we are going to get the current url so in order to get the current url you should use driver dot get current url the return type of uh, the get current url method is also a string so we can see that in sysout as well first we will see this because this get page source string is quite a large and it may replace this title and get current url so we will comment out and then go to get page source before that we will see how this get title and get current url is working so i'm going to execute this now so it print the output here in the console window if you see title is google and it get the current url as well so this is how the get title and get current url works so let me comment out and we will now move on to get page source so this get page source return type is also a string and we can see the page source in the sysout So just execute this one so if you see here the javascript as well as html source code are written as a part of string when we are using the get page source so this is how the get page source works and now we will see the difference between close and quit so normally the close command is used to close the current tab or current window and this quit command close the entire browser so that is the basic difference between close and quit so let me execute and see so first what it will do means it will navigate to google and maximize the window and then close here we are using a closer if you see this if you see this uh, in my screen it's alternately open a new tab it's because of uh, the antivirus i have installed that's why it opened this window and when it reaches this point it closed the browser that is a google tab it op it closed the google tab but still it open this tab that is a settings tab is still open 
because I'm using the close command. So the purpose of the close command is to close the current tab. But if I replace this with quit, then it will close entire browser as well. So let's see how it works. So if you see here it's navigating and maximize the window and it closed the entire browser so there is a basic difference between close and quit so these are all some of the most commonly used browser commands and in the next video we will see web driver commands as well thank you for watching this video if you like this video give thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel bye bye